Magandang buhay at welcome sa aking channel. Ngayon po ang aking pong ituturo ay about joint and combined variation. Ipapaliwanag ko po how to find the constant k of variation and the equation of variation. Ituturo ko po yan sa inyo step by step. Okay, bago po tayo mag-solve ng constant and equation of variation, i-define mo muna natin yung first joint variation. A variation where a quantity varies directly as the product of two or more quantities. So, ang joint variation ay one quantity compared to two or more quantities. So, ano po ba ang ibig sabihin niyan? Ito po yung example ng statement of joint variation. Number one, why varies jointly as X and Z? So, nabanggit po yung word na jointly. So, joint variation. Bakit po joint? Ito po yung unang quantity na sinasabi niya. And then, ikinocompare natin sa two or more quantities. So, dalawang quantity po dito, X and Z. Kaya po sinabing jointly kasi dalawa po yung quantity. Okay? If you translate that into symbol, that is, Y is equal to K, X, Z. Wherein, sabi niya, product of two or more quantities. Ito po yun, X, Z, meaning to say, X times Z. Okay? Number two, A varies jointly as A, B, C, D. Okay, so ito yung first quantity natin. Then varies jointly sa product ng two or more quantities. Ito po yun, B, C, D. Okay, pwede kasing two or more. Yung number one ay dalawa lang, X and Z. Ito po ay tatlo. Pwede pong maging apat yan. Ano po? So if you're going to translate, that is A is equal to K, B, C, D. So, parang direct variation lang yan. So, ito na po yung three quantities B, C, D. Okay? Number three. C varies jointly as D and the square of E. If you notice here, meron nang nabanggit na square of E. So, pwede rin yung square sa joint variation. If you are going to translate that statement, that is, C is equal to K, D, E square. Kasi binanggit po niya dun sa statement na square of A. Kaya E raised to the second power. Okay, so bago po tayo magpatuloy, click lamang po ang like and subscribe kung bago ka po sa aking channel at yung notification bell upang sa ganun ay ma-update ka sa iba pang video tutorial na aking i-upload sa mga susunod. Sa ngayon po ay nagagawa po ako ng ibang learning task at performance task sa mga susunod na lesson. Okay? Find the constant of variation and the equation of variation. Example number one. If y varies jointly as x and z and y is equal to 24 when x is equal to 2 and z is equal to 6, find the constant of variation and the equation of variation. Okay? Sa ating statement, nabanggit yung word na jointly. Ibig sabihin, joint variation po itong statement. Okay? First, to get the constant of variation and equation, ay kailangan natin i-translate yung statement into symbol. Okay, let's try to translate. So, yung first quantity is y. So, y is equal to, then, yung dalawang quantity, x and z. But, always write k first. So, k, then, x, z. Okay, yan na po yung ating symbol. So, para makuha po yung constant, ay substitute natin yung given. First ay y. So, y is equal to 24. So, 24 is equal to yung k. Remain yung k kasi yun ang hahanapin natin. Yung value ng x ay 2. So, lagay natin doon times 2. And then next, z is 6. So, times 6. Okay? To simplify, paano po isimplify yan? 24 is equal to Ang unang i-simplify po muna dyan ay yung 2 times 6. So, remain yung k. 2 times 6 is 12. So, 24 is equal to k, 12. Ang hinahanap natin ay k. So, may kasamang 12. So, divide 12 to both side of the equation to cancel 12. Okay? Kaya, ang matitira po sa right side ay k. At sa left side, 24 divided by 12 is 2. Yan na po yung constant of variation. How about sa equation of variation? 
kukuin lang natin yung ating original equation. Y is equal to k x z. And then, substitute lang natin yung constant na na-compute natin. So, y is equal to k 2, then yung variable na x z. So, yan na po yung equation of variation. Okay, so for number 2 example, if M varies jointly as Q, R, and S, and M is equal to 48, when Q is equal to 3, R is equal to 2, and S is equal to 4, find the constant of variation and the equation of variation. So again, nabanggit po dito na varies jointly, meaning to say, joint variation po itong statement. Okay? To find the constant of variation, Translate natin yung statement into symbol. Yung first quantity dyan ay m. So, m is equal to. Then, meron tayong three variables, q, r, and s. So, constant muna, k. Then, yung three variables, q, r, s. Yan na po yung symbol. So, we are going to substitute the given. m is equal to 48. Kaya, 48 is equal to. Constant remain k, yung q i 3, so 3, r is 2, so times 2, and then s is equal to 4, so times 4. Okay, how to simplify again? 48 is equal to k, remain k, and then you are going to simplify first 3 times 2 times 4. And what is 3 times 2 times 4? That is 24. Since may kasamang 24 yung k, I-divide natin ng 24 yung both side of the equation to cancel 24. Kaya ang matitira sa right side ay k. And then, 48 divided by 24 is 2. So, the constant of variation is 2. Okay? For the equation of variation, just copy the equation or symbol. M is equal to kqrs. And then, substitute natin ulit yung constant na na-compute natin. That is 2. And then, yung variable na QRS. M is equal to 2 QRS. Yan na po yung equation of variation. Okay? So, how about this number 3 example? If Y varies jointly as B and the square of C, and A is equal to 32, when B is equal to 2, and C is equal to 4, Find the constant of variation and the equation of variation. Again, nabanggit po yung word dito na jointly. So, this is joint variation. So, to find the constant and equation, translate natin yung statement into mathematical symbol. So, first quantity, A. So, A is equal to yung constant lagi, K. And then, we have here B and the square of C. So, B at yung C daw ay may square, kaya C raised to the second power. So, yan na po yung symbol or mathematical symbol. To solve for the constant, substitute natin yung given. A is 32. So, 32 is equal to remain yung K constant. Yung B ay 2. So, 2. And then, yung C ay 4. So, 4 raised to the second power. May square yun kasi may square yung C. So, to simplify, unahin natin yung 4 square muna. Okay? So, remain muna yung 2. So, 4 square is 16. 4 times 4 is 16. And then, 32 is equal to K. Multiply natin yung 2 times 16. That is 32. Again, to solve for K, may 32. Divide 32 to both side of the equation to cancel 32. So, ang matitira po sa right side ay K. And then, sa left side, 32 divided by 32 is 1. So, the constant of variation is 1. Okay, for the equation of variation, just copy the mathematical symbol. A is equal to KBC square. And then, substitute the constant. A is equal to K is 1. So, 1 times B times C square. Yan na po yung ating equation of variation. Since 1 yung K doon, Pwede lang pong tanggalin, pwedeng A is equal to B, C square. So, yan na po yung equation of variation. Okay, so how about for combined variation? 
a variation with a combination of two kind of variations. So, ano po yung ibig sabihin niya? Ito po yung example ng statement for combined variation. Number one, y varies directly as x and inversely as z. So, dalawa po yung kind of variations nandito sa isang statement. Yung una po ay direct variation at yung pangalawa ay inverse variation. Kaya po tinawag na combined variation. So, paano po yan i-translate into symbol? Ganito lang po yan. Una pong i-translate yung first variation. So, y is equal to varies directly, kaya direct variation muna, x. So, k, then x. And then, inversely, so, when say inverse, so, divide by. Ano po, nasa denominator po yung inverse natin. Then, yung variable na z. So, divide by z. So, yan po yung translation ng statement. Okay, so for number 2 example, A varies jointly as B and C and inversely as D. So, dalawa po yung kind of variation na nandito si statement. Yung una po ay joint variation, jointly, and inverse variation from the word inversely. So, ang unang i-translate natin ay yung first variation, yung varies jointly. So, A is equal to, joint siya kaya dalawang variable, B, C. So, K muna and then BC. And then, yung second variation, inversely as D. Kaya, divide by yung D. So, divide by D. Yan na po yung translation ng statement. Okay? So, how about this number 3 example? C varies directly as D and inversely as the square of E. So, again, the same sa first example na direct variation and inverse variation. Pero, nagdagdag ako dito ng Square of E. Ano po? So, meron po tayong word na square. So, to translate, yung first variation muna, C varies directly as D, kaya C is equal to K D. Then, inversely, kaya divide by square of E, kaya E raised to the second power. So, yan na po yung translation ng statement. Okay? So, how about Find the constant of variation and the equation of variation. Okay? For number one, example. If y varies directly as x and inversely as z, and y is equal to 8 when x is equal to 2 and z is equal to 3, find the constant of variation and the equation of variation. So, yung statement po natin ay combined variation kasi meron pong direct variation at meron pong inverse variation. So, to find the constant, translate mo natin yung statement. Yung unang variation mo na, yung direct variation. So, yung first quantity ay y. So, y is equal to since directly, kaya k. Then, yung second variable is x. So, kx. Then, yung next variation, inversely, kaya divide by yung variable na z. So, yan na po yung translation ng statement. Then, solve for the constant. Substitute the given, y is equal to 8, kaya 8 is equal to, remain yung k, x is 2, so k 2, divide by z is 3. Yan, so divide by 3. Then, by cross multiply, multiply lang natin yung 3 sa 8, kaya 8 times 3 is 24, then, matitira po yung k2 sa right side. To solve for k, since may kasamang 2, kaya divide 2 to both side of the equation to cancel 2. So, ang matitira po sa right side ay k. And then, sa left side, 24 divided by 2 is 12. Yan na po yung constant of variation. Okay, for the equation of variation, kopyahin lang natin yung mathematical symbol or equation. y is equal to kx over z. Then, substitute natin yung na-compute natin na constant na 12. Kaya 12, then x all over z. So, yan na po yung equation of variation. Okay, so salamat po sa inyong panood. Nawa po natulungan ko kayo sa inyong aralin. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more video lesson.